Hello everybody and welcome back to Analog Vernacular. Today we're going to be playing some more of The Last of Us Part 2. And uh, we are currently in a memory. Uh, this is two years ago. And uh, right now we are trying to get some new guitar strings for uh, our girl Ellie. So we're here with Joel. Let's get going. Looks like it was shot a while back. When did the last patrol go through here? I'm not sure. Is it one of us? Nah. Only people went missing from Jackson and them teenagers from last year. This one's too old. I would just roamed in. This way. We are on patrol, right? Look like a runner, too. Okay. Let's take him out. Okay, not too bad. Used up a lot of that bar, though. I think that the bar might actually still be more effective, even with the durability, right? Or does every melee weapon have kind of the same damage, essentially? Let me know in the comments if you know it all. I don't actually know. Could go either way, honestly. Go over here! Just a minute, Dad. I gotta look around. Okay. Good job, kiddo. I mean, if you would have let so me explore before we opening give up it, on come on, man. Could have said it better myself. <laughs> I think our only way out is forward now.
Okay. Okay, is that everything? Looks like it. It looks like it might be something. Following you. Hope you're not claustrophobic. My God. did it. <laughs> it was still too close. <laughs> you good? Uh, you know, than being really old, ain't nothing a solid night of sleep won't shake off. I want to get out of here. our way out? Nope. Okay, where are we headed? Alright, looks like maybe we'll move this stuff. What are you doing? What if there's like two bloaters back there? It'll be fine. Clear. Oh. Quite the fight back there, huh? Not often we get a bloater around these parts. Yeah. Jesse and Dean are gonna lose their shit when they hear about this. Let's deal with them too, anyway. A date, right? <laughs> uh, on and off. Why? Oh, so they dated I for a while. Jesse talks about you. No, Jesse and I are just friends. No, 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 I've got a pretty keen eye for these sort of things. Not so keen with this one. <laughs> Does he not know that she's <laughs> lesbian? Don't hold your breath. Has she never told him? I mean, I guess she didn't in the first game. Maybe he really doesn't know. I wonder if that's why she's being weird right now. 
to, she's like trying to work up the nerve to tell him. You can do it, Ellie. You can do it. You know Joel will love you no matter what. We know that by the time that the, the current time, I believe he knows. Because of what happens at the party and him punching the guy. I don't even know if we're going to get into any more fights. So I don't know if it's really that necessary for me to be looking for loot. But hey, RP, baby. Gotta play the role. You think you can squeeze through there? See what it is? Yeah. Okay. Jackson brand. I think it's them. A couple that ran away last year. Mm. And one of them became a clicker. I think you're right. Jackson is a wonderful place, but we got tired of hearing the stories of people suffering everywhere else. We wanted to save lives. We had good intentions. We didn't make it an hour before running into a horde. Now we're bitten. We've decided we're gonna end our lives instead of turning. Please tell our family and friends that we're sorry. Love Adam and Sydney. I shot her. I can't take my own life. I'm a fucking coward. Adam. Jesus. If only they were immune, right? <clears throat> well, let's... Hmm. Let's go get Tommy and we can get these bodies back to Jackson. Yeah. After you took me out of the Firefly oh, Hospital... Oh, here we go. You said there were dozens of people like me. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's what they told me. I've never met another immune person before. Have you? I could be hiding it. You do. Do you believe that? She always knew. Is now really the time for this? We traveled across the entire country to bring me to the Fireflies. I had so many questions for them. Why did you pull me out of there while I was still unconscious? Because I let them run their tests. And when I saw that they were useless, I got us out of there. How do you know they were useless? Maybe if you, you just uh, would have given them more time, they could have figured Ellie. something out. There was no cure. There's nothing that could help these people or anybody else. I know you wish things were different. I wish things were different. But they ain't. And we need to get these kids back to their families. 
Is there something else you'd like to rehash? No. Good. Come on. I don't know, man. Maybe you should have come clean right there. She knows something's fishy about it, and it's been bothering her ever since. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Ow. Jesse's passed out. Hey, let me do that. He's a good guy. Why didn't you tell him? Wasn't the right time. There you go. He'd probably try to get Dina to about leave with him. Anything go somewhere well? safer. Uh, actually, yeah. Uh, Abby? Uh, no. Darn. This girl, Nora, her unit was assigned to this hospital. They were collecting supplies or something. This hospital? Yeah. Wait, you're gonna go now? Yeah, we have a lead. Like, at least just wait for Jessie to rest up. She could be gone by then. Helly. We know her location. Maybe Tommy does too. What? Nothing. Good. Can you come help me with the door, please? Follow Route 5. That should take me to the hospital. We can wait a little bit. Use up a little bit more of that durability and then we'll uh, upgrade it. Man, we used a lot of ammo. keep those out and then I'll pull out the sniper when I need it because that one's mostly a long ranger anyway so that just makes oh, more sense I think track down Nora get her to tell me where Abby is easy route 5 that away You know, we still haven't actually met any scars. Here we go. It's actually kind of interesting, because, like, they've had, like, this huge build-up, and I feel like when we finally meet them, it's going to be something special. I should probably make sure there's not infected in here before doing something like that. What do you guys think?
Randy Stiles. Once he was Dr. Uckman's research partner, working late nights to develop all manner of technology for the betterment of mankind until one day he just vanished. Months later, reports surfaced of Stiles showing up in numerous places all over the world. A brief appearance in Mexico, a short stint in Japan, a materialization in the Australian outback. With each visitation, he helps people in need and vanishes again. Some speculate Stiles obtained this ability through an accident with Dr. Uckman's experimental quantum teleporter, though he vehemently denies those claims. Neutral. Oh yeah, I like that. Oh, I hear you. Can I open this door without alerting them? I actually don't know. Yeah, alerting them might be the only way in. Let's see if there's any broken ones further on. Okay, no broken windows. He's not moving. We have to. Okay. Where'd the other one go? Note on one of them. Woods, here's the list of deserters. Ji So Huang, Andre Dominguez, Chris Marsh, Adam Peters. We know some of the supplies they stole contained weapons. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. here we go. Be careful. While it's preferable to capture them alive, do not risk your lives. Any sign of danger, you have my permission to take them out. If they wanted to leave, we could have worked something out. But desertion combined with stealing cannot be tolerated. We need to make an example here. May your survival be long. May your death be swift. Good luck. Isaac. Interesting. Yeah. Um, we need to find those weapons, huh? They might not even be in the immediate area.
Okay, we're starting to run low on a lot of different stuff now. everything in here. I wonder how close those weapons might be. Wherever they are, I want them. All right. have been here. Mm. Another person they hung and disemboweled? Yep. That's exactly. Okay, so we read up to the fuck the wolf, right? Yeah. Jesse's here. This is good. He can help protect Dina. It felt good having him around to deal with that WLF. Maybe he can help us find these people more quickly. I don't want to hear anything about turning back. I feel her love. Who the fuck are these people? Why did they do this? down, but up. There's a rope that might be our way back down. Now we can just get back this way. So we'll have to keep an eye out for what we need to use that rope for. thinking. How are we going to use the rope to get here? <laughs> like throwing it. We need it higher so that we can swing, right? So... So I might actually have to break that manually. Hmm. Would a bottle work? 
<laughs> Alright, I kind of need the other side broken too, though, don't I? Pick it up. And let's just see... Alright, that's not close enough. Probably these two. And I might be able to just jump to it from here. Okay, let's... You think that's, uh... Good enough? Okay, it's R1. I was trying L1. Okay, let's go down a little bit. This is clever. I like the way this is set up. I don't know if we're going to make it. <laughs> okay. Let's try that again. We're, we're on the right track. Let's pick up another one of these. We might need to break something a little further on. I almost want it to bridge over those two. How about if we just go straight through there? It really just depends on if I can jump that far. Alright, move as close to me as possible. There we go. Okay. Gotcha. All right, what do we got? Worth it. Unlock. Yeah, let's figure out if there's anything else in here. Need, not bandages, painkillers, vitamins, antacids, thermometer, and not pillows. All right. 37 days. Simon, I hope you never read this note. I hope I can crumple it up, burn it, when you return for us. It's been, I don't even know how many hours since you left. I went out to look for you and these hooded people spotted me. They shouted at me, called me a sinner, then started shooting. Mm. I ran back in and barricaded the door. All I can hear is the rain, but I'm worried they're still out there. Should I run? Should I stay? I feel completely paralyzed. I'm sorry I got so sick. I'm sorry I let you go to the hospital by yourself. I'm sorry I didn't stay hidden like you told me. If anything happens to me, I want you to know how much I love you. Please come back. I'm so scared. Paige. Is Paige the one that's downstairs? Or is Simon the one downstairs? Probably Paige. Man. And Simon died somewhere else. Shit. 
shift. At first glance, Gail Price looks and acts like a typical teenager, mood swings and all, but those mood swings power her ability to increase the velocity of matter. When happy, she directs this power outwards, increasing the speed of her allies and throwing her enemies off balance. When sad, she directs this power inward, allowing her to outrun her enemies and make the rest of the world feel sluggish. Though powerful, she is an unpredictable ally and an easy target for the mind manipulation tricks of Motivator, a neutral hero. This wasn't the weapons that uh, was in that other note, by chance, was it? It might be. So that was, sorry, that, that prompt was for the rope. Does that look like it's enterable? No, okay. Looks like it might be. Okay, can't go in there. I think we're going through this building. Or here. Okay. That might be our way forward, so... So much for following the street. <laughs> yeah, you're not kidding. Go ahead and save before we go in here. Let's see what they got in here. Probably infected, for one. Yeah, explosives is what we're missing the most of right now. be fine. Maybe this is where the weapons are, st are stashed. Interesting. Is this door going to be locked? Bet you it is. Okay, we're going to be jumping over there. It's 
a nice little flat. Freaking huge. I bet you in Seattle this place would be real expensive. Man, the city's still filled with supplies. Hmm, I wonder why that is. Like when the WLF took over, they just not comb the buildings as much or something? Uh, finish looking around real quick. Okay. A range finder. Oh shit, I heard that too. I was like trying to back out. Okay. Isaac can go to hell! Get down! Weren't with the WLF, man. It didn't have to go this way. Jesus. These are the deserters, though. Fuck people. These are those deserters. Ooh, man. Sorry, man. Didn't need to go down like that. Yeah, man, I was like mash and circle to back out of this. Because <laughs> I heard him running up on me. Okay. Draw speed is not bad. Add a rangefinder. Mark the distance of enemies on the reticle? Oh, for the drop off. Huh. All right, we're gonna finish exploring this and then we'll uh, prob we'll probably find some more parts and maybe then we'll decide if we want the rangefinder or not. We're probably gonna get something for the bow. One of those three. I guess that's why there were so many supplies in here is because it was actually home to these uh, deserters. Hey, Melissa, I'm leaving this here in case you decide to join us after all. We're moving on from the safe house at first light. I've stalled the others as long as I could, but Isaac has to be looking for us by now. The fate of the last group of deserters is still fresh in our minds. The plan is still to head south and see if those rumors are true. Maybe it's all bullshit, but I'll take hopeful bullshit over Isaac's fanaticism any day of the week. Rumors are true. Is it about, uh, Jackson, maybe? Hmm. I don't like a lot of people knowing about Jackson. Feels like, uh, people might come after us if... Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Remember who we were. The WLF took us in, but they're not our people. I really wish you had left the stadium with us. Hope you still do. Jiso. Okay, so... It seems like their main headquarters right now is the stadium. Probably because of the scars. The scars may have pushed them to the stadium somehow. Yes. Oh, oh, yes. Organic. Useful. Chemistry, concepts, and practice. 11th edition. Explosives branch. Explosive arrows. Improved trap mines. More effective trap mines that are deadly at greater range. Effectiveness of molotovs. Spreading fire in a wider radius. Oh, all of these are good. More of the same. Okay, so you craft just more, which is really good. And craft more explosive arrows. Hmm. 50 range, hold breath, craft more arrows. I do want that, but I kind of want to go down this tree, too.
more effective health kits. That hasn't been too much of an issue. I use those a lot, so. Top off. do one of each. I really like these mines. Gotta be more careful. this other room and then we will see about upgrading oh wrong damn button um is it x yes it's gonna be x <laughs> whoa okay that was close Darling, I got everything packed, but Fedra's already starting to put people on buses, and I have no idea where you've disappeared to. If I'm gone before you get back, I stashed a few of my things in the safe. Maybe an overabundance of caution, but Fedra's been confiscating things due to quarantine. All smells fishy to me. Combination is still set to our wedding date. I mean, it's been 30 years, but I assume you remember when that was, right? See you soon. Love, Ellen. Okay, we need to look for something that tells us their wedding date. Okay, nothing in this room that seems to have a wedding date on it. Oh, calendar. All right, health screening, evacuate, and the uh, 30th anniversary is I'm on October 8th. So, 10, 13. Well, not 13. It'll be 30 down from that. Okay. Star sign. Once a humble museum curator, Zhang Lei was poring over Han Dynasty scrolls when he found himself transformed by the spirits of the great Chinese emperors. Now, depending on the hour of day, he takes on the elemental power from each sign from the Chinese zodiac. Uh, terrakinesis, pyrokinesis, aquakinesis, ferrokinesis, and arborkinesis. He also takes on both the positive and negative personality traits of each sign, which can be an advantage or disadvantage depending on the situation. Best hope you catch him at a good time of day. Neutral hero. Okay, October 8th. Is 
so October 8th and um, 2013 minus 30 so 83 right Okay. Very nice. Okay, we didn't actually find any more parts. Okay, maybe a lighter string. That one costs 60, and that one 80. I want all three, honestly. Man, it feels bad that we had to kill those those peeps. Really didn't have to go down like that. Go in here, fight some infected, grab that, jump over. Guaranteed, that's what's happening. This will be locked. Uh. Okay, it's quiet right now means I think we might get swarmed. <laughs> if we end up having to make noise to open this thing. Um, anything to pick up? Okay, there isn't Actually, places where infected can really come at us, I don't think. So maybe we're okay. Okay. This will fall through naturally on the incline. That's the idea. Okay, fine. Don't stay open. Maybe the incline's not. What are our other options? Let's try that one more time. Nope. So... What can I do about that? <laughs> okay. I get you. Alright, we're gonna be on the back of this. I'm assuming it'll roll somewhat slowly. I sure hope it does, otherwise this is gonna be tough. Nailed. 
killed it. Honestly, this That's pretty smart. Elf. That was the hint I needed. <laughs> Didn't register that that ramp was right behind us. There it is. Fuck. Thought I'd be closer. Okay. Well. That's a fucking dope view. Lake Hill, Seattle Hospital. I think this is it. Watch for big red sign. I mean, I don't know. I think this is a pretty nice view to end this thing on. So, uh, yeah. Thank you all for being here. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next one. Have a good one.